Okay, here's the inside of the tiny travel trailer, the teardrop. It's very, very hard to get good video because it's so small. But, here's a couple of the LED lights. The little light up switches. Bolt meter. Two 12 volt outlets. AM, FM, uh, CD player. 12 volt RV lights. The little shelf over top of the radio. One shed window. Okay, there's the sleeper RV sofa. Air conditioning. other windows on the other side again another RV light another little storage shelf this is the view from sitting on the sofa you can see there's a little living area here this area is 76 wide by about 64 deep. That would be 64 inches from my back where the air conditioner is to the doorway. See speakers in the corner. You can see the underneath of the shelf. You can see the roof. The headliner material is missing in this little area. But I have plenty of headliner material here to redo it. You could probably redo the whole thing, or at least this, the living bedroom area. One outlet, 120 volt household outlet. Of course, the air conditioner is plugged into one behind the couch. This, I refer to this as the kitchenette. Another double working 12 volt outlets. I mean, 12 volt lights. Two shelves here for food storage and cookware or whatever. Shelf here, of course, for water. A place underneath for a big cooler. This is a bigger than a lunch size lunch bucket playmate cooler I built this little area right here to accommodate those fold up lawn chairs another outlet for the coffee pot or whatever heater whatever you need and then this side I built this to accommodate a porta potty. This area here is about 28 inches wide by two feet deep. And this area is about the same size. This area for the porta potty, I was just going to hang a curtain from here to here. It's just me and my wife. But, well, I got to get rid of it. Anyway, the back door I never did quite finish. You can see the uh, oak plywood, oak blue wine, whatever you want to call it, paneling. But it is oak laminated. The top side I did not get finished. The whole thing is insulated with one and a half inch foam from Lowe's. 
and all the interior walls are all that oak laminate. It's stained with a light or medium walnut stain and I finished it with linseed oil. All the windows open, these two here, the one on the door, the one on the other side. Um, I will pause this and I will go outside and shoot some from the outside. Um, like I said in the ad, pictures really don't do it justice. I really doubt if this video will do it justice either. Um, yeah, it just looks a lot worse in pictures.